are already having oceans of fun this summer participating in the Library Summer Reading Program. Stay tuned to see what else we're up to this week. The Rowlett Public Library has been super jazzed to see so many people visit the library during summer break. And we've had so many people register for their summer reading program. It's not too late to register for the Reading Challenge along with other fun programs for all ages, even adults. So visit Rowlett.com for more info. At Tuesday night City Council meeting, City Council presented a proclamation recognizing the month of June 2022 as National Post Traumatic Stress Disorder or PTSD Awareness Month. On June 27th, the historic water tower will be lit in teal for PTSD Awareness Day, helping to spotlight this issue and the support available to everyone who suffers with PTSD. Also on Tuesday night, Officer Ryan Dotery was presented with a life-saving award for his heroic actions on the afternoon of February 26th, which resulted in preserving the life of a citizen who is actively overdosing. This award is such an honor to receive, and we're so grateful that Officer Dotery was able to save their life. June is almost over, and we want to highlight one last cat in honor of National Adopt-A-Cat Month. Meet Shannon, the cutest little female calico kitten who is needing her forever home. Meow. Visit the Rowlett Animal Services Facebook page to learn more. If you're looking for a way to cool down tomorrow morning, then come meet the Parks and Recreation Board members at Paddle Point Park at 8.30 a.m. for their Paddling with the Parks Board event. Visit the Rowlett Parks and Recreation social media pages for more info. We hope to see you there. And that's been your Friday at 5 this week. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe on your favorite social media channel so you don't miss a thing.